Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'll show you how to organize your scene graph. Let's get started. So I have my model open up here. And the one that I want to show you guys is the scene graph. So at the moment, my scene graph is unorganized. So scene graph is similar to a layers property on AutoCAD or Photoshop, where every objects that you put here will be added on the list. You can even hide or unhide them. Similar if I hide the big waterfall, I can basically do that. So it's basically important to organize your scene graph. So to do that, let's go first inside the house. And as you can see, here are the list of my furniture and they're all over the place. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna select one of this and then right click and click new container. I'm gonna put furniture and then enter. And that furniture, I'm just gonna put it right below the rocks folder. So now this is organized by either selecting individually all the furniture so i could select the wall tv and then drop it to the furniture folder you can also use the filter so by going to all and then selecting furniture by selecting all the furniture you can basically select one of this so the one at the top we already put it in the furniture folder but the classic and all the way to the bottom so i selected the classic first and then hold the shift button and select the one the the one in the bottom so now i basically highlight all of them and then i'm gonna go back to all and as you can see it's still highlighted everything so now i'm just gonna drop it to the folder so now when we're doing this everything will be in that folder you can also add this one right there and then now if we hide this it will hide all the furniture or if we unhide this the fastest way actually to do this is if you know that you're working on something that will take longer and you're gonna add that specific object so what you can do is to select it as a active container so right now let me show you if we add in more trees that tree will just go below the scene graph so if you keep on adding, we'll just keep on adding into those. So in order to automatically organize this, you must first create a new container. Let's call this trees. Then enter. So once you created that, just put it below the last folder. So now let's organize this first and let's add it to the trees folder.
to set this as a active container you must right click on the folder and then set active container once you do that every time you add a tree into your model it will automatically be added onto that folder to go back you just simply select the scene graph again and select the as a active container and it will go back the way it was so now this won't be added to the tree folder thank you for watching and i hope you liked the video please hit like and subscribe feel free to comment down below